That's right, a producer, author, and comedian, Yvonne Orji. She's here today sharing lessons from her brilliantly written book, Bamboozled by Jesus, which is a true ode to inner freedom. Now, we are standing behind three beautiful plates of rice. I'm going to explain that to you in a second. Stick around. But I want to get to something in the book, because I didn't realize you were competing in the Miss Nigeria in America pageant. So you're in that, and you said it was the contest, and you prayed, and you said to the Holy Spirit, what should I do? What's my talent? Yeah. And the Holy Spirit said, do comedy. And I was like, stop playing. And you were like, stop playing, <laughs> Holy Spirit. But in your book, I love this passage. It says, hear me clearly. You are more than what you believe you're capable of. Yeah. You've been called out of your old self, out of your former expectations, and out of your own self-imposed limitations into the more that's available and waiting for you to tap into. Yeah, yeah. And it, even though that story was a humorous story, that's what I felt the connected tissue of everything you've accomplished. Because if I never leaned in and did that, y'all wouldn't know me today. Yeah. That was it. It was like one moment of pushing past fear. Because I, I was bullied as a kid, and I was performing in front of Africans. If you're not funny, they will not even boo. They'd be like, whose daughter is that? <laughs> <laughs> like, from this place? Like, you know what I mean? Like, I just didn't want my people to beat me down. And so I just was like, well, at some point, I got to either trust that God knows more about me than I know about myself. Yeah. And so pushing past that, and it was crazy when people laughed because I wasn't expecting it. I was like, <gasps> I was almost scared about that because then it was like, oh, what he said is true. Sometimes when we get the blessing, it's scary too. Yeah. But, um, but the fact that you can walk into it even with being afraid, that, that's the freedom. That's the freedom. Ooh, that's the freedom. That's the freedom. Okay. So... Nigerian Independence Day is October 1st. I saw that you follow Nigerian superstar Burna Boy. Hey. And, um... What's up, boy? Yeah. So, Burna Boy, you were at his concert in, in London. London. yes. Burna Boy was with Complex, and they did a Jollof rice taste test. Okay. Now, for full disclosure, we have a Jollof recipe on our website. It's from Bo St. John. She is from Ghana. Mm. And Bo's recipe, I believe, is one of our most viewed of all time. Yeah, you well, have a I, funny Jollof rice story when your 21st birthday with your mom? Yeah, well, I, what, whichever one is the Ghanaian one, I want it. That's you know? <laughs> <laughs> For I'm, your I'm birthday. I'm sorry, Bo's, but I'm... Mm, ah. <laughs> your birthday, you love it so much. Your mom made it for your 21st oh, yes. birthday. So I was, I was a, uh, I was at GW. I was a senior, and I was like, Mom, all I want is for you to make jollof rice yeah, and bring to my yeah. friends. Now I know she was planning a whole surprise party for me, and she worked at Howard University Hospital as a nurse. So she's yeah. like, I'm doing 12-hour shifts, uh -huh. and I was like, Yeah, but can you still make this rice though? <laughs> and so she, in order to not blow the surprise, she spent all night making jollof oh. rice for me and my friends. And they, they knew about the surprise party, so they were like, Yvonne, it's okay, like, we don't need the rest. I was like, why can't I have what I want? <laughs> it's my I was, birthday! I was, I was like, I'll be asking for nothing. And so she, she came through, and then the next, like, two days afterwards, I was surprised. It was amazing. Okay, well, we, I'm not gonna surprise. I did not make this rice. I can already tell you right now, whatever that is. No, is stop it, stop rice. it. Because no. it's not red. These are, no, you are going to taste each one of these, and you are going to tell mm. me which one you like the most. So let's start over here, and then I'm going to, re you're going to say, now, don't look at the color. Okay. Just, <laughs> just eat. That's what they say when I'm dating. Don't look at the color. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. You're going to make wait, me lose wait. my mind up okay. in here. Okay. Never, okay, hold on. <laughs> That's not bad. It's not good either. <laughs> Go to the next one. Okay. No, to the chef who them. made this, thank you. Oh, bless you, baby. <laughs> If I confess that I made this, would you just? <laughs> All right, come on, try I would say stick to me. That's all. <laughs> the shame. Okay. Okay. okay, do one more. I mean, we got mm. two more. Okay. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Okay. Mm. Well done. <laughs> I know my people want to see it. The heat, the heat, the heat. I don't want to do this one. <laughs> I can try it. Try it. First of all, it got basmati rice. You don't make your love with basmati rice, but it's okay. It was on sale. That's the rice that was on sale. <laughs> <laughs> You're taking this person. I feel like you did make this. I did. Okay. <laughs> okay. to be the judge. Which one did you like best? I'm not answering. Oh. <laughs> okay. I mean, I feel like the audience saw our reaction. 
it's, hold on. It's the right color. It's, other countries. No, don't do it. <laughs> I want to see. See? Issa, get your people. Issa, get your people. This was not it. Zoloff, Warloff, whatever y'all call it, that was not that, it. That, okay. So, that's, that, but. So we know who won. Happy, happy Independence so Day. So, we're going to show the third rice? Oh, we already saw it. Oh, they saw it. This is both, is this you? <laughs> I have divided all you of my friends with this one contest. We, uh -huh. <laughs> but I'm just saying, y'all saw the reaction. I'm gonna be yeah. Go so it is, it is, um, mm. it is, it is. It this one is it. This one, I, I'm not getting into this battle. I wish y'all could this taste one was it. it. I wish y'all could taste it. By the way, the recipes, TamaronHallShow.com. Snap our QR code on the bottom of your screen. I adore you. You, you gonna put this one on your website? <laughs> <laughs> you are trying to get me in the middle of a battle that I am not equipped for. I, you gotta come to Houston with me. We gotta come to, cause that's Oh that's yeah, you're middle. gonna be in Arlington, Texas. Yeah, you're running my state. Hey! hey all right. Make sure you check out the book and guess what? Yvonne's book, Bamboozled by Jesus, How God Tricked Me into the Life of My Dreams is in stores tomorrow. But guess what? Today, everybody is getting a copy of this beautifully written love letter to freedom, to authenticity. I adore your mother.